Hello everyone, this is Ron. Welcome to another King of Fire Software video. And in today's video, we are going to talk about the upcoming updates a little bit and we are going to do whatever things that we have to do before the reset or before the update because we do have to complete this battle card carnival and also we have AG challenge point we need to complete this and collect all the rewards because we still have only one day left and if you don't complete this within this one day these things are going to be expired guys now about the update regarding the banner and the character at the time of recording this video I have so far confirmation about the uh, update regarding the character known as Isla she is going to appear uh, as the new ultimate character in the upcoming banner is she going to be a free character is she going to be banner character I still no, don't know anything about it but so far we don't have any news about this second fighter so looks like she is going to be the only fighter probably she she might be a all-star fighter too that remains to be seen but we will see uh, but probably she's going to be an XV fighter king of fighters 15 if you go to your codex you will see that there's a lot of lot of king of fighters 15 fighters and she is going to be under this tag however so far we don't have any ultimate fighter in this list and all the fighters that we are having are ex fighters so she's going to be first of her kind a king of fighters 15 fighter but at the same time she's going to be an ultimate fighter now let's move on to the things that we have to do first of all this battle pass thing we need to collect these rewards I haven't really bought anything from this battle pass I I think this is not a good one because the main rewards are going to be some rubies and some of these things which is not really worthy at all in the shop section we do still have these packages but I haven't really made any purchase this time this might be a good deal for many and now let's proceed with this challenge carnival event first of all we are going to take a good look at this battle card carnival event so far we have made this progress uh, we don't even have 15,000 points still we need to go a long way to get to this final reward so let's go to the Kaya special summon and there are actually many F2P ways to face this sort of uh, uh, carnivals if you have in future. For example, I have heard a superbly F2P way that is to save up your 6 star cards in this inbox and don't just accept them, right? Because when you accept them, you will get those points. Let me uh, go to my cards and just do a little bit clear up Need to go to the equipment section bell card and see my inventory is kind of full so I need to combine some cards we are going to use this simple combination see we are getting carnival points from here too these are also a free way these are also nice f2p friendly ways to actually complete this carnival look at this we are getting a lot of points simply just going through this combination of these apparently useless cards but now they are really useful so saving a lot of cards in your mailbox might actually help you to do these things however we, we would like to convert some four star cards even converting this four star cards we're getting a lot of rewards guys let me do some more quite a good progress i think 
now let's convert some three star can we get some points yes we are getting points from converting these three star cards as well it's so good guys so i think we are done with converting the cards can we collect something let's collect each and everything from the box see we're also getting points from here these are f2p friendly ways guys if you do have uh, like six star cards for example look at this i just got 1200 points i think that was some six star cards or something look at this 7000 points and also i'm collecting these points too these are other carnival points so i think i collected all the cards and can i do some con conversion okay four star card we can do one more and that's it guys i think now all our cards are gone and let's see how far we have done in our battle card carnival event look at this guys couple of thousand points we already got but still we have to get about uh, i think 50,000 points or so that's a lot and for that we have to do some pulls let me do the free pulls so you have to you know do these things on a daily basis that means farming these uh, battle card tokens for example these ones i don't really have too much see i don't really have too much and let's use them wow look at these huge points we got three thousand points couple of uh we got one special card from Yuriagami. This is dope, guys. This is superb. We can do another pull. Let's see what we get this time. This time, not so much. 400. This time also around 5,500. By the way, don't forget to set up this select pickup to select your favorite card from the PT because as you progress further, you will reach at some point this selector. And from this selector, you are able to select any one of these card. And usually I would like to prioritize this card these cards because some of them are providing me shock damage some of them are providing high critical rate critical damage these are good card guys so let me do one more pull <clears throat> let's skip this all right nice good look at this we're getting this card from the pickup so this already this card is already selected in the select pickup option so this is also going to increase the chance of getting any particular card these are really you know nice mechanisms let's keep this thing okay look at this another card from the pickup so good all right very good we're getting good cards
Look at these points, 3000 again. Any 6 star card will give you a quite a good amount of points. Skip it. And by the way, about pulling the characters from any banner, I think this is the highest time you should prioritize on getting max up character guys. If you cannot guarantee max up characters, you should not pull. Because in the upcoming days guys, the age challenge or the guild boss challenge, these things are going to be even more difficult. You need to have characters that has kind of uh, momentum in the core. Nice, nice, look at this. 9000 points. Oh my goodness. This is so good. Six thousand points. I think we are getting quite a good progress, guys. Let me check out the progress. Almost, guys. Look at this. And I think I still have some cards here, probably. And by the way, we are also getting these diamonds. These diamonds we are getting. We can use these diamonds once again. In the KF pools. No, we don't have any cards, I guess. No, we do have cards. So let me collect. We're getting the limited amount of rubies too. Look, 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 guys, lot of cards. I think our carnival is almost done. Now we can check. Still, we need about 10,000 points or so. My God. So this is not even that easy. If you, you know, cannot play regularly and buy these things from the chain shop. Uh, what is the I think this one not this one but of course these are also very important to buy these things in the soul dust exchange shop you have to buy these battle card summon tickets every day because you can just do it only three times. You can buy three three of these each and every day. That's all. So you have to buy these things on a long term basis. Daily make it a habit in your daily tasks. Now we can do some more pulls. See, we are almost near the PT. I think one more pull and we will reach the PT. This is a standard card banner, guys. It was so good to pull after in this card banner after a long, long time. And really thank Net Marvel for giving us this reason to pull. Now see that our PT is over and we already got a selector. The selector will be. Uh, let me watch this. Thing. Oh. Wait. I forgot to, you know, charge up my device, by the way. And these are the selector, guys. The new selector just I just obtained this one the latest one is also saved and the previous ones are also saved I can use these standard banner selectors and get some good reward guys now I would like to do some Kea banner pools because these are the diamonds let's spend some diamonds 
3000 carnival points look at these these are really good looking sets these are going to be useful guys really free nice sets so good to see that the game has arranged this mechanism I totally hope that they are going to give us some buffs in these sets too so we can actually use this set in a competitive ways too and it would be such a great experience to get these sets and you know try it in this upgraded EX fighters going to be an amazing experience guys a lot of points we are getting I'm gonna do two more pulls. Okay, we also get character memories. However, character memories will not give you any points. Look at these special cards. Amazing. Terry, old version of Terry. These characters uh, that are available in this banner were once considered as top tier characters. And this was once considered as a very, you know, top tier banner where the meta characters are available. So you can get a couple of extra copies from the meta for, for your meta characters. So look at these guys. 80,000 points achieved. Now you can claim the rewards. And of course, we just claimed each and every reward. All the rewards are in the inbox. I hope they gave me the thousand rewards, thousand rubies too. I, I, I hope it is already automatically, you know, added. I believe because I haven't really counted. So the battle card carnival is done. AG challenge. And I have already collected all the points. As you can see, let me claim these rewards. Oh my God, look at this. <coughs> look at these rubies. So sweet. However, the most important thing is there is a couple of things. You need to do there is this watch shaped icons this means you have to use these things before the update is gone so let's use these things up let me take you to the inventory so first of all ue fighter prime memory shards we can collect some shards let me collect some for oswald because currently i'm working on him Face fighter memory summon box. Let's use this thing. And uh, we got quite a good number of face fighters. I wish they were also getting some buffs, guys, because these fighters are amazing. Now, EX element memory summon box. This is going to be a random box. So let's use this. And what we got? We got EX generic memory and this is going to be YOLO element memory. I don't know how useful this is going to be in my account for now, but for future for sure, for sure. So these are the things that I wanted to show you today. So all of these challenge carnivals are completed. All the rubies are home. All the rewards are home guys. And I have used all the items that I need, needed to use. So this is how you need to complete each and everything before the update, a major up update comes. So thank you for watching. I hope this video was helpful to you. Don't forget to support the content, support the channel. And I hope to see you guys soon in some other videos. Till then, stay awesome and peace out my friends.